Hi there, Mark Duffy. Um, here just to give you a quick introduction to our new feature for 0 0.9 which is streaming um, objects. I'm just going to switch off uh, the map. Um, the whole idea here is we're in a, one of our locations on the Unifier site called Aberdeen. Um, it's actually Marshall College. It's about a 16 megabyte download um, which if you're in a fast broadband area isn't too big at all, however, um, for people who are unlucky enough not to live in a fast broadband area, 2 megabytes was uh, taking about 20-30 seconds to download. Um, what we've been able to implement is a way to actually get you in world quickly and objects will only appear as you get close to them. So you'll actually see I'm in, if I make this bigger for you, um, I need to go to game, make it bigger. As you can see, um, I can't see anything else bar this first part of Marshall College. Marshall College should be above me to the right. Um, as I walk closer, the, as you see, downloads off the internet. The, the uh, gatehouse has appeared, and as I move along, different parts of the building start appearing. Now, that's great if you live in a slow internet connection area. Um, it's just a shame for you. However, what we can do now is change the level of detail and actually turn it all the way up. So if you are in a fast connection and you don't mind once you're in world that everything then starts to download, um, set your level of detail to high, um, to the right, and start moving. And as soon as you move, the whole project starts to download. Now, that's great. Um, this way we can get you into the world really, really quickly and as you move around, objects will start to appear as you want to. I want to show you how we do that. Um, in the scene, you'll see we actually don't see the objects. Um, if we go to Unifier, we can do Undo, uh, undo Optimize Project. And you'll see different parts of the mesh start to appear. And this is what the scene would look like when completed. So you may look at something that's tall, far away, and think, well, this is quite dominant. We want to see it. Now you'll see at the moment, um, each object that is streamed has this uh, configuration script and it has a radius. Um, now that's how many meters around that object before you'll actually see it. So we've set it to a default by 20 but that can be different for different parts. So the tower for example it's very likely you'll see it from further away. So we're going to change that to 200. Um, and that's all you need to change. We'll go back in at Unifier. We're going to optimize the projects for streaming again. And it's going through all the uh, prefabs, getting them ready to be streamed. If I go play and start to move out, you'll see, well, I should have done both sides, but there you go, that that object, even though I'm down at LOD of low, or as low as it goes, I'm within 200 meters of that object. So you can have towers above buildings that you can see, and of course, uh, a collision, a col collision um, works as well. Um, so this is a great way for you to get in world quicker, to download assets only as you get close to them. Um, so you're not downloading really complicated models that are other side of very large locations. Very simple to do, um, and all part of the new 0.9 Unifier API